Okay, so our theme was same as before. Collaboration. Correct. So this time I said collaboration because they were working together to the you know. To defeat the witch. No, not to defeat the witch. The ghost. Dorothy Dorothy sprayed water on him. Yeah, I I know that she sprayed water on him, but I believe like if they hadn't have worked together, they wouldn't have got to that position where she could have sprayed water and like destroyed the most. Yeah, also they would have just got ripped by wolves. You know how if they were for the Tin Man, they would get ripped into pieces by the wolves. Yeah, and if you were for the bees, the bees, remember? Yeah. The bees saved by the Tin Man as well. Yeah. And then the, the lion defeated the, uh, oh, I forgot. No, the midgets. Yeah, the midgets. The lion's it's called the midgets. And then the, um, the scarecrow, they, he scared off the dangerous crow. Yeah, but the king attacked. So the other crow started attacking, but he cracked their neck. Yeah. So they saved him from... Yeah, yeah. One thing I don't really understand is, as you read, hot, most of the, most of the time, the only people collaborating together are the uh, scarecrow, the like the scarecrow, the lion, and the timon. They're all kind of collaborating to save Dorothy. Yeah, but Dorothy in the end kills the witch. In the end, yeah, yeah. Well, she. So that's the important part. Okay, and also. <laughs> So um. So she did actually pay them back because we asked the question before how she paid back. She paid them back by killing the witch. So now they can get their wish. I get. It. And also, if you think about it, what sort of happened is they did like they all did many little things, and to repay Dorothy, did one big thing. It's kind of like the final step they had to take to uh, get to get their stuff that they wanted. Yeah, but, you know, without that, they couldn't have got anything, because then there's no point. If we were, even if they helped, Dorothy was just still the one who got captured and threw water at her. Yeah, I know. So look, let me just draw it out. But if you try doing that, it's actually because of the witch, because without the witch making Dorothy angry, she wouldn't have to drink water, and she would have lived as the slave forever. Yeah. And also, if you, uh, I agree with that, and then that comes to my point, how Dorothy did one big thing, right? Yeah. So if you think about it, look at this amazing creature, see? A stair. Yeah, so look. This is basically what happened. They want their heart, their brain, and courage. But this is what happened. The Tin Man, the Lion, the Scarecrow, the Tin Man, the Lion. They did all of this stuff. See, they did the... Small steps. But then Dorothy did that one final step that led them to their victory. Victory. Yes. So I think the the author really is just trying to tell us about um I think the author is really just trying to tell us about how like without them she could she couldn't have killed the witch, but on the other hand, without her they could have rich got the which they wanted. Yeah, and also if you go to what, what I don't really understand is what was the humbug? It's on chapter sixteen. Humbug. Yeah. Six, chapter sixteen. It doesn't show the chapter. Here, chapter sixteen. Chapter sixteen. The magic art is a great humbug. I have is that like a metaphor kind of thing for? I think it's a creature. I kind of, I kind of believe that the author was trying to use it as a metaphor, being the great wizard of Oz. I think that's what they were. That's what it was trying to use. Oh, right, so. Because in the chapter, that's starting to you know yeah. when they get back. But one thing I've noticed in the thing, you know how her which is awesome and powerful guys got like owned by Dorothy and her friends. So why would they get owned if they're her elite team of guys? Because even if Tin Man was that powerful, wolves can still kill other guys. Because Tin Man, they can get past Tin Man since they're really fast. But I guess and they notice that their guy is dying, and they, they should just aim for other guys. And so it's so still the witch is rich. What happened was the great wolf, right? Yeah. He went for the Tin Man, and the Tin Man was standing in front of all of them, 
So that's who the wolf, like that's what you would think to take on first. Like just say there were two giant, you were like a robber, right? Yeah. Two, I mean a murderer. Two giant guards here. What would you most likely do first? Kill these guys or run right past them where they can easily take you and go for the what you wanted? You go for the guards first, right? Yeah. So that's basically what they're doing here. They've got the guard here and then they've got the other guys behind him. So the wolf takes him on, die. So the other one wants to fulfill what he was trying to do. So he took him on. Yeah, but, but the one thing I don't get is why they went one at a time. It's not like attacking. Well, partially I just understand. Part partially because stop scratching your chest. Alright, so partially I believe that the teeth if a teeth and a metal fights, who do you think will win? Well metal usually. Most likely metal. Because yeah. it's hard. So even though they might have succeeded, even though they might have a pack, the teeth will break. Yeah. And they'll be all made to do that. Up, 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 up. So let's see, what do you, let's just, as we close this conversation, what okay, do you think is going to happen next? Um, well, it already told us that Oz is not actually a wizard. Yeah, he's one of those little cheating men, right? Like, he's not a midget, but he's just like a weak man. Yeah. He just acts powerful using that head. Head and the uh, screen. Mm. So, which how Toto do... found out. <laughs> <laughs> which Toto found out. Yeah. Toto. So, what do you predict is going to happen? I kind of think that he's not going to do what they asked him. Yeah. Because he's not as powerful as they said. Yeah, but, but like. Also, in a way, if they, he has to do it somehow. He, he has to do it somehow, make it up with something. Because if, she, if you know how Dorothy told him that if he didn't do it, he, she's got to tell the yeah. people that she, it, In a way, Dorothy's really evil. Like, she's really smart. Yeah, she's smart and manipulative. She's like making, forcing him to actually do it. Yeah. I think he's going to... Okay, so let's close this meeting. Ding, 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 ding. You have the right.